Yo, what is up guys, it's Fully Space Tech, and today I'm going to be playing around with a kind of unique style of building this time. I've never really built with things like concrete, and uh, recently I saw a video from, uh, I believe Foley, or uh, YT. Uh, he actually uploaded a video of him building a house out of blue concrete, and uh, I was really curious to see how building with concrete actually comes out, as I literally never build with concrete. A lot of my builds are like wood, um, stone, or cobblestone beneath. Um, anything kind of like that, or it's just textured wood the majority of the time, and I've never really built with concrete. So I thought, in this video, why do we not try and build a house together, just kind of out of concrete, or well, I'll try and build a house, and we'll see how it kind of goes. Um, but I'm going to be using well, yellow concrete, um, you can use whatever colour concrete you would like, but we're going to play around with this design, and we'll start out by just kind of looking at the base foundation that I've created here. So as you can see, we've got a five wide foundation. So we've got five along here. And then from here we go one, two, three, four, five. And we repeat the same here. One, two, three, four, five. And the same here. And then obviously we connect this all the way to this part here, um, which is literally just matched. So once you get this bit here, so you go five, 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 and then five, which will take you to here. Uh, you can just go along to this point here and match that. If you want to know how many blocks that is, we go one two three four five six seven eight nine and then obviously from here one two three four five six seven eight nine so they're just nine by nine and then the rest of this is five just so we can get that narrowed down uh, and yeah let's get on with the building so i really want to see how this goes so i'm going to start off by building everything at about this what are we saying three three high is going to be maybe a bit too small uh we'll probably start with four um yeah four might be the one to go with here so we'll go with four. Um, we've got to look out for places we want windows too. So I'm going to have a window there. We're going to fill that section up and maybe we go have like a larger scale window here too. Um, so we we'll go somewhere like this and then cut across here like so and fill this gap in. Then we we'll head on to the back piece here uh, and I want to put this middle section in so I can add some more windows there. Probably the back of this house can be rather plain. Uh, I don't want to add too many windows. Maybe we we'll get like a two windows there in the back here and then we fill in this back wall so there's not really anything going on here uh, head over and we just pull this top bit over fill it in and we leave these two back pieces for windows here and obviously on this side I'm gonna add a window maybe here because it's not gonna be a window on this side so we're gonna have at least one now this is probably gonna look really weird as of right now it's just kind of a giant um, you know it's just kind of a giant yellow thing that doesn't really make any sense so we'll just start kind of adding in this spruce here i'm going to head across the kind of outer section like here and then actually just kind of extending this so we're going to go stair then a backward stair we'll place a spruce plank on top we want to get a kind of good height to this roof and make it um quite tall something that's quite nice to look at as well pleasing to the eye um the roof is probably going to be a lot more um something that wants you want to look a lot more better or, or something that's one of the main key, key points to this build as um, creating something uh, out of yellow and not really being able to texture it too well I probably could use some other yellow box to texture it but we want to take away from the yellowness of the build and really give something else that kind of stands out so I'm actually going to copy uh, the roof all the way around to this side with the exact same pattern due to the fact that the roof is the same uh, these blocks are the same on each side we should be able to get a nice even roof and connect those up but that will look really nice uh, for the kind of build it will look very symmetrical and everything will fit perfectly which is great so we just want to copy this roof by building two up um, it's exactly the same as that one over there and then we do this now all we need to do is just fill this in with the planks so we can kind of head around and fill in here this should end up creating the exact same all the way around and it'll be a perfectly fit roof for this build um, so yeah hopefully this will take away from the yellowness of the build uh, obviously yellow is quite a bright color so maybe building out of yellow was uh, quite a bold choice it's probably going to take up a lot of the um, color palette as you can see here it's going to just be one of those um, really bright colors that we kind of have to tone down a bit by using things like spruce because it's more darker um, and we kind of get this, just a nice little um, feel and texture kind of with the two mixed together it looks a lot different than just having um, a bright color so if we're using yellow and using something like sandstone it's just not going to work they're two two very similar contrasting colors and they're just really bright as well um, but they probably will not work together and i just realized i've placed stairs here 
instead of planks, which I should be doing um, to finish off this section here. And then obviously going up with some planks, getting the thing, uh, getting the roof kind of finished there. And then we want to get slabs, trap doors, and use the kind of general slab, uh, trap door slab, trap door slab effect. Uh, it just kind of creates a nice little wave to the roof. Um, and it's just a nice little effect to have instead of keeping a plain flat roof it really just brings out the small detail to the roof here as you can see now we've got this kind of nice looking roof on top of this a very bright uh, looking looking um, area here it's very 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 bright and I'm not sure um, building with concrete is something I don't really do so when building something like this this could look this could look interesting this looks very interesting I'm a very very um, how would you say very very confused right now I'm probably going to go with the window being that height, so we're going to go with this here, um, and then obviously we want to go three. That'll be four. Uh, so on the inside, that will be this height. So this will be the main height. Obviously, you can still see out the window there. Um, so that's going to be what I'm going to use for that. So let's get some windows in here. Um, right now, I'm looking at the front of this and thinking it looks very plain. So we could actually knock that out for that, but that's going to look horrible. So maybe just grabbing a door, a simple door. I'm just going to go over something like a spruce because, or maybe actually a, the better door to use for this might be the dark oak. Uh, the dark oak will probably look a lot more better. It's going to fit the more um, fit more to the build itself. And then uh, building with glass panes here, like so. And then just fit in the windows that I created earlier. Then we do the same for the top up here as well. So we fill this section in. And then we'll come around here to the exact same. So we've got that filled in as well. Now this is looking very bright. Uh, something that isn't terrible. But it is very, very bright. And um, I'm not really sure how I feel about it to be honest. I definitely feel like maybe adding some oak uh, logs just at the top here. To kind of fill out that. This is going to look very rusticky. That's my issue here. So when you do something like this, it's going to look rusticky. But we're going to have a yellow kind of source uh, as our block here. Which is going to be a bit odd. Um, something I wasn't really expecting when building with concrete is uh, this. I'm not used to building with concrete. So something, um, it's just so bright compared to a lot of the others, a lot of the other things you generally build with. Um, but we'll roll with it. We'll see how it turns out. Um, I'm not really the greatest when it comes to building with something like this. Um, so we're definitely going to try it. So we're going to get some lanterns, some oak trap doors. We get some grass. Uh, we get some normal trap doors. We get some leaves, uh, composters, uh, composters. And then what else do we need? Just a small array of flowers. So I'm going to go with something like these up and these. Why not? Let's see how this goes. So I'm going to start with some composters like so. Uh, then I head up here. I want to get a nice little wavy effect in there. We can add a, tra we can add a lantern to that. So we can also add a lantern to that. There's two different things I can do here. I also want to add, the, add a button to these. Um, so I'm going to add a button there. Uh, would you know? We'll keep that like that for now, um, as it's probably going to need it as much as I can. Really, uh, that's probably going to need that lighting really to brighten up that section, due to the fact that the way the house is angled, the sun is not reflecting onto the door. Um, anyway, we will get some nice little small uh, kind of outside decorations to kind of brighten up the outside and not make it look so plain out here. Um, so I'm just going to use things like trapdoors of grass and then obviously throwing down a different array of flowers. Uh, go with things like composters and leaves and then obviously you can just add some trapdoors with leaves on top of them as well. So I've done on this side, I actually used a spruce one here. Um, so we do that, uh, we can add things on here. Uh, we'll get the wavy window effect in there too, like so. Uh, here I'm going to add... What am I going to add? Probably one of those, and then we add something like this, and then we can do the same on this side, and then we just add a small array of flowers there too, and then around here we do the one, two, three, put these down, add the flowers in, like so, and then here we can go with just a, a trap door, and a gate like that, and then we could probably even go with two if you really wanted to. Um, really give out some more but I'm going to stick with one uh, and then just add in a few lights here and there so we're going to throw in a light on that section here um, I can add one there too and add one each by uh, kind of each top of the windows there 
Um, so we've got one here, and yeah. It's just really lighting up this area. It's actually looking a lot better now that I've got some foliage around it. Um, yeah, I was not expecting it to look this kind of good. Obviously, I feel like we're going to have to bone mill things around this path here, um, which I'm going to do in a second, just to kind of give it a nice, uh, you know, nice little feel to the build. But this section here feels very plain and boring, so maybe adding something to that is going to spruce it up. So I'm not really sure what I can add to that. Um, so maybe I could go with... No, it's just going to look very odd. Um, so as you can see here, when this is just something that I'm going to so now so when I'm building uh, like this you can see here I'm all you know I've got a few things where I'm kind of struggling to fill in space and I'm not really sure what to do with it um, so as you can see I'm just playing around with small little uh, designs I can do and uh, don't be afraid to just play around with them obviously you can't always get everything right um, so just playing around with these small little things are gonna be the reason that you get these nice looking designs uh, so don't be afraid just to play around and place blocks you can always remove them and try something else so anyway we got this done I'm going to jump over and quickly finish the outside with a bit of a world edit so we can get some actual foliage and things in here. Um, this is actually looking fairly nice from what I originally started as. And yeah, and we'll see what happens once I am done with this. So I'll see you in a sec. So now that the house is complete, I'll show you guys what I've been up to. So from the outside, we completed the whole house and I showed you how to build it. All I did, because we're in a super flat world, was head around the outside with loads of gravel, coarse uh, dirt, and then obviously fill in a load of trees around the edges too. And then from here, I went on the inside and actually decorated the inside. Obviously, I've got some stuff out to look like some person's kind of moving in. Uh, so on the inside, we have carpet. As soon as you walk in an armor stand, before you leave the house, you can put your armor stand on. Or your armor, even not your armor stand, because that would be weird. Uh, you got a brewing section here, a crafting table here, a nice little seat there, barrel for storage, uh, more storage here, chest, and then some barrels sitting on some trap doors. Little kitchen through here, uh, where it just funnels down with this little kind of trap door that can let you into your little kitchen. You've got cake sitting on a little platform here. You've got storage all underneath these, so you can actually use these for storage. You've got a uh, furnace, crafting table, a uh, little sink there to wash your hands, and obviously someone to sit and eat, and then obviously you can head upstairs as well now. You've got another little place to sit, more storage up here, a few lanterns, and then obviously you've got your little bed in the corner there. Uh, yeah, really simple inside, nothing too fancy. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This house is a, quite a simple one for you guys to follow along with. Um, nothing too too bad, but I just wanted to play around with the kind of concrete design and try to build a house with concrete. I thought that was a great uh, idea to try and do. As uh, as I said before, I saw it from the uh, Foley's YouTube channel. I'll leave a link in the description um, just so you can guys can kind of see what he did with his. Um, but I took the inspiration from that. I've never built with concrete, but here's the here's the result. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a like and comment and subscribe for more. And I'll see you all soon. Peace.